Now we're doing free code camp, JavaScript algorithms and data structures beta, learn basic JavaScript by building a role playing game. Step 89. All right. So we can insert variables into a string with the concatenation operator or the plus sign operator, whichever you want to call it. Uh, we're going to update the you now have a new weapon string to say you now have a with a space and the name of the new weapon. And we're going to remember to end it with a pardon me, in the sentence with a period. So here's an example that creates the string. Hello, our name is free code camp. So we've got const our name equals free code camp in a string. And then we've got const our string equals hello, our name is with the space after it. And then plus our name and then plus a period at the end of it. Right. So that's basically how we're going to do this thing. So let's just select the end of the string from new weapon from the end to after the period. Let's uh, delete that. And then after this, what is it? The quotation mark. Let's have a space, a plus, a two spaces and another plus. And then one more space with some quotes. And inside the quotes, let's put a period like that. That way it's a little bit easier. Now we're going to put inside of here this variable, right? So we'll get this and we'll drop it off like that, right? And so it's going to work, but, uh, well, it probably work. But let's come down here and see what we did. So let's select current weapon, hold down alt, and also select this line right here with the let, let new weapon, copy it, drop it off on 98, and then under there, let's do a console.log, console.log. And inside of these parentheses, let's get all of this right before the semicolon. Let's copy it, drop it off in here, and we can see in the console, we now have a dagger, even though it doesn't say dagger, but it does say new weapon, which equals current weapon, pardon me, weapon and current weapons dot name like we did in the last video. So that's basically how that's going to go. Let's uh, get rid of this stuff right here. Check the code. Looks good and submit it. All right. Now we're on to step 90 and we'll see you next time.